Shay, this woman shared with us that multiple gunmen stole more than just a car. They took her last memories of her recently deceased father. I worked hard for my vehicle. I paid it off in full. And it's how I get to work. I can't take my daughter to school right now. She missed school last week. So I just want him to stop for everybody, for the sake of Memphis. Chelsea Allen's home was stalked by suspects around 11 p.m. who tampered with her security camera. But her neighbor's camera caught the chilling moments when they returned, guns drawn, targeting her front door and garage just hours later. She says the gunman stole her car, her only transportation, right from her driveway. But the fact that they pointed guns at her home is traumatizing. And then he stood here and held the gun at the garage, I guess in case anybody were to open the garage. Um, we're in and out of the door at all times. We come and grab stuff out of the car. We come and bring the dogs out. So it's scary to know there was one person just standing right in our doorway. Um, and you can see in the video, they're both just holding the guns up while he's backing the car up and he jumps the curb. And the guy that was standing here with the gun jumps in with him. And then the guy in the white hoodie runs back and gets into the black vehicle and they pull off. She says what's worse, the stolen car held sentimental value. Her father just passed away less than a month ago, and in the car she had his belongings. She's begging the thieves to return the car, or at least her father's memories. Find a way to turn your lives around and do the right thing. And if y'all have to, just take the stuff that's out of the car and drop it off at a police precinct or drop it somewhere I can find it, that would be appreciated too. She says the car, the car is a gray two-door Infiniti G37X with a broken passenger door handle. So far, no arrests have been made. For your news leader in Cordova, I'm Alan Self, WREG News Channel 3. Well, hopefully some answers coming for her 